to the left blinker. Okay, here's the blinker switch, turning it off. Left blinker still blinking. It could be the years of meditation that allows this spirited man to wonder as he's fixing this instrument cluster and blinker again. Why? Why does he keep fixing things? Why not just replace them? Okay. My theory is that something's wet in here. This bike is 14 years old. Even the BMW dealership has trouble fixing it. They don't have the repair manuals. The parts cost a fortune. The time and money he's put into this bike makes no sense. Water gets into the instrument cluster when it rains. It almost never rains here. Maybe it's a single drop of water makes its way into the motherboard or whatever it's called, circuit board. One drop gets in there and shorts the blinker circuit. Or the corrosion arcs the circuit, maybe. But that's all that's wrong with this bike. The blinker won't turn off. Left blinker stays on, right blinker don't work. That's it. Okay, moment of truth. Come on, come on, please, 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 please. All right, all right, it's off, it's not blinking. All right, well, it's blinking on here, but now it's not blinking on here. It's blinking on here. Is it not? All right, I'll figure something out. All right, I don't know what I did, but here, watch this. Left, left works, left. It turns off, off, victory. Not exactly out of the woods yet, because I got to put this back in the, in the assembly. Supposed to be writing the video right now. Turning the electricity off Thursday. Gotta finish the video by Thursday. Shouldn't be getting yourself into this repair right now. Why? Why keep putting in the time, the money? Why build a shelf during the middle of all this? Why the shelf for two bottles of cough syrup? Supposed to be writing a video begging the world to stop shooting vertically. Stop shooting video like this. It's just lazy. You're cropping the frame. You're not adding anything. You're just robbing us of what's going on on the right and what's going on on the left. Cinema evolved to bring us the widescreen because our eyes are side by side. We see the world through a horizontal rectangle. Only one reason to shoot vertically, only one, and that's laziness. Too lazy to tilt the phone 90 degrees. Why? Why does he care so about the horizontal frame, about not shooting vertically? Why fix the blinkers yourself? Why a shell for two bottles of cough syrup, those berries that make lemons taste sweet, half pack of Alka-Seltzer plus cold nighttime, and energy mints? Why? Insomnia, thinking about why. So he got up and wrote down why. He figured out why and wrote it down. 
laying in bed, thinking about the blinker fix and the video that must be made, and they're shutting down the power, the electricity, and the blinker and the video, if he's honest with himself, the blinker and the video hold the same importance in his mind, the same urgency, even though they are three spare vehicles, including a brand new motorcycle. So what is this thing that compels the shelf-making, blinker-fixing, and horizontal shooting lecturing? It's obvious what this thing is, this compulsion. The thing that compels the shelf-making, blinker-fixing, and horizontal shooting is... His spirit. okay to build a shelf for two bottles of cough syrup. It's okay to lecture about shooting horizontally. It's okay to remove the instrument cluster again and take it apart again and install it again. It's all okay because the compulsion comes from his spirit and damn it, the artist's job is to preserve the human spirit. So let them turn the electricity off tonight. Turn off the power. It's broken still. All that time wasted. So I failed. But the video is done.